Hello fellow YouTubers, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Blind. On the last episode, we uh, did four shrines very quickly and managed to get the last remaining piece of the stamina wheel that we needed in order to complete it whole. Uh, we also then, after that, headed off to the southern part of Hyrule to go get another tower, and we did. And that revealed a lot of the Gerudo Desert to us, including the location of the next Divine Beast, or the final Divine Beast, I guess. So, on this episode, we're going to go back to the shrines, because I don't want to go that way yet. <laughs> no, that way is dangerous. We'll go that way. We'll go that way later. That looks awesome, though. Do I see any shrines that we haven't done yet? Nope. Don't really think I'd see that far. All right, yeah, we're going to be doing some more shrines. We're going to be doing the ones that are right here, that one, this one, and the one at this stable. And then we'll probably be... We'll see how fast we can complete these ones. Because if we have some time, I might, <laughs> I might be risky and attempt to go towards that uh, first memory spot. The first picture, at least. In the middle of Hyrule Castle. <laughs> I have no hope for that one. We're going to go towards it, and we're going to get caught. And we're going to teleport away like the coward that we are. I will see how many of the monsters we can collect, because we need some lizards, we need some horns, we need some bass, and we need some choo-choos. A lot of them are up here. See, there's that tower right there. All the trees around it. That's actually pretty close. Yeah, I could easily just go up there. Where am I going? This is exactly where I needed to go. Can you walk away from our destination? So you're making good progress. If everything goes according to plan, this is what, 36? 37 will be the one that we finish off all the shrines we found. 38 will be, well, be us climbing up the mountain to get to that guy. And then 39 would be the, the Vine Beast. Or should we make 40 of the Divine Beast and do, like, another walk-around episode? Ooh, God, there's lava in this one. To use that foot in this shrine, I am Moa Keet. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. That looks broken right there. It disappears as soon as it hits lava. Excuse me. I missed. Not getting close enough. Can I do this? I can't. I'm supposed to do something in order to break that. I have bomb arrows, don't I? I do. Hi, chest. I guess that's it. Ruby. There's okay, so there's still another prize I need. need to do is I need to get I didn't stop it in time I didn't stop it in time again oh that's annoying no I can't get past it Got it a little too early. Aha. See, and this one should be simple. Let's need a magnesis in.
clogged up there. I think I'll need this Manisa's thing to get over to the other side. Another? No, I need you. Do I have a Knight's Broadsword? Because I could just swap them out. I do. Do I have a picture of a Knight's Broadsword yet? I feel like I should. Hasn't stopped me before from not getting one. I don't. <laughs> that, doesn't look, that doesn't look good at all. Take this with us. We're basically just gonna use this and bully our way through all these all these uh boulders. You just wait there. Now I can go. Pardon me, excuse me. But you better stay at ground level here. You're going this way. Just a giant bully. All right. Yeah, there's four, there's four balls up here. Five. Got it. Oh, they all disappear. That wasn't so bad. I I should make a I should I should buy a lot of weapon racks for my house. Cause I'm gonna need them, so I can at least uh, ho I could at least hoard some stuff. <laughs> like I can put weapons on there that I know that I'll, I'll want to keep. I don't need to hold every single weapon I have, but I need to keep something wooden, something metallic. I'll probably keep on to this Meteo Rod and this Ice Rod for the time being because having them both would be very helpful with dealing with certain problems, I assume. It just sounds so peaceful here. This required a Shrine Quest, so this is this going to be a blessing? Or not. Probably not. Although it would be nice. Be very nice. We earned it. Not really, we didn't really earn it, we just flew here. Hot springs. These lush thermal baths are found throughout the world. You can relax in them for a while to replenish your hearts. Ooh. I don't think we've seen hot springs yet. Okay, it's not a blessing, unless this is a weird type of blessing. To you, that's in this shrine, I am Tom Mool. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Passing the flame. Another fire-based one, huh? That is not fireproof. Or that's not fire. Yeah, just use this. It's easy to understand. A lot of fire. A lot of chests. Uh. Get that. Get that. A lot of treasure chests in this area. I have to get them all. Cobble Crusher, no! Oh, 
Oh, this is way better than a cobble crusher. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna grab the cobble crusher, but I'm gonna keep that stone smasher. Don't have a picture of that yet. That doesn't help. I need better pictures. Otherwise, I can't tell what they are. Did I burn up the chest? Because the only thing that popped up was this opal. Oh, no. Please tell me that's metallic. It is. Give me the key. Yeah, the keys are metallic. Can I take a picture of them? This is the first time we can see one out, out of its thing. I know, I know, I'm getting it. I gotta grab that stone smasher again. I burned up the treasure chest. A ruby! That was it. That was the last one. Hold on, there's goodies inside these, aren't there? I guess not. Ah. That was super simple. Having the having the the fire rod really helped. Wasn't like a tough problem at all. I can only imagine how tough that would be. Had I not had any wooden things. I have fire arrows too. Not a lot. I could use some more. Never pass a bit of opportunity to investigate things that look out of place. Hasn't stopped me yet. Although I will start needing some more here soon because I, I'm hitting that wall again where I, I can't carry everything that I want. It doesn't help that I do these in order pretty much. I just have an episode where I go through four of them because I get some pretty good rewards for going through them. Oh, that looks like a good one. That is a good one. Found another reward. Oh, that Korok-related thing down there. Shut up, Radar. That's a goodie. Some topaz, get some flint. Amber's kind of good. Can I sell rock salt? Oh, there's some fire choo choo's there. I already fought you guys, didn't I? No, I didn't. Yes? I did? No. I did not. Forget it. <laughs> you might be a blessing because we had to fly up above to get to you. Or else you're another... You're another uh, wind-tempered one. I wonder if there's a way you could tell what to expect from the inside of the shrine. It's either wind-based, it's wooden-based, metallic-based. I haven't had a lot of water ones, but there have been some. Sometimes you fight an enemy, sometimes you don't fight anything at all. I mean, I'm just... I'm, I'm naming a lot of examples. <laughs> Use this power to lift up metallic objects hidden in water. Oh, we didn't grab that chest that was hidden in, like, the mud stuff. We'll get that the next time we go there, though, because I feel like... I feel like we're going to jump off that building. <laughs> and we're going to, we're going to like, glide into the desert. Oh boy. Ooh, a laser. To use this foot in this shrine, I am Shea Rada. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Speed of light. Am I rotating it? Is this a 
time-based one and a water-based one. It looks like what I'm going to have to do... Well, first I got to find out where the... Where the chests are at. They might be under there. No, I can't get under there. Or can I? There's a chest right there. And there's a chest right there. Okay, it looks like this is going to destroy. So what I think I might have to do is... Rotate this thing. Hurry up. Is that is that really it? Was that is that the, was it that simple? Ooh. Except for now, I gotta get this. Well, that's in place, so that's just gonna stay there. Oh, there's a treasure just right there, too. Good thing it came back. I would have totally missed this one. Opal. Contains the power of water. All right, so once again. Okay, I see what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I don't. Is that going to be weighed down by the water? I don't see that'll lift up that barrel. That's a metallic barrel. It will. Which closes that door. Here's something I can do. Or at least attempt something. How long will that last? Put one there. I just want to get this set up properly. Because I want to go over here as soon as I can. It actually blocks that, kind of. I don't trust it to not break. Ooh, that was close. All right. That's going to hit it. That's going to hit the thing. Cause the water to go down. That's going to go off. Raise this. Still have my bomb. 
Activate it again. Now I'm trapped in here. That's fine, because I could probably just throw a bomb over here again if I need to. Giant boomerang. Why do I never throw things that I don't need <laughs> for the time being? Thank you. And it goes away. And there's a treasure chest. Yay. That worked out. Okay. Eight fold long blade. Don't have a picture of that yet. There we go. Nice and proper. Giant boomerang. Nice and proper picture. I'll take that though. Aha! The bomb helped! It was just problem solving how to get the water back up after I open up that door. Is that already three shrines? Are we gonna get through this faster than last episode? Guess the, I guess this game really wants me to give a chance at that first that first memory. We will be getting a heart piece for this, or heart, heart container for it. So that'll be nice. Give me more health before I die. <laughs> I wonder what another another piece of a stamina wheel would look like. If I can get another piece of the stamina wheel. Oh, it sounds all grumpy down there, don't ya? Was that four? That was four. No, that was... Yeah, that was four. Or that was three. This will make it four. Information about the rupee... The rupee... Or what was it? Bloopy. There we go. <laughs> forgetting... I'm forgetting animal names. Herald Compendium. I think the weapons are going to be the hard part for the compendium because I keep on I keep on forgetting to take pictures of the weapons we grab out of chests. We're doing better now. Better than we did before, at least. There's plenty of like rusty broadswords and stuff that we got on the great plateau that we need to go take pictures of because we didn't have our camera then. Ooh, is this a blessing? Oh, no, no, it's not. To you who says foot in this shrine, I am Kea Wan. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Shields from water. This is, this is not a blessing. what it means by shields from water. Is that thing up? He knows I'm here. the bomb arrow oh that one was enough whoop I can get that arrow back though <laughs> what a nice jump Ooh, I can't climb that from that way I can climb it from this way though 
the whole extra ring is really comforting at this right now compared to when I first started. Okay, that was that was dumb. <laughs> I didn't know this was the first one I made. Be kind. Ancient core. Nice. Still don't know what they're for. Ooh, there's a wooden platform there. I think I'm supposed to kill both of those things, and then I can get inside that. Or else I could just... Lift that gate up. Block your vision for now. No other th other things. Oh, they're not even metallic. No, the current. This is going to be a problem then. This side. Yay. Another knight's broadsword. Getting a lot of them. They're nice one-handed weapons, though. back down here I probably could have eh, I don't think I could have do this get a nice starting point you got all the chests I hope yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything else here at four shrines in under a half hour and none of them were blessings I feel so accomplished they were pretty simple shrines though so now we have that okay our new plan uh Let's go to the Temple of Time. We'll go get the thing. We'll go get the upgrade there. Then, because we haven't we haven't been to the Great Plateau in a while, then we'll teleport over to the. We'll teleport over to the. Can I tell? Can I just teleport here? I can. That's probably closer than the tower. Eh. Is it closer than the tower? Probably not. Be nice to come back to where I woke up in the first episode, though. 36 episodes later. <laughs> it's been 36 episodes in this game. That's how many episodes it took us to beat Batman Arkham, Arkham Asylum. And the first Resident Evil. And I feel like we're nowhere close to being done with this game. I never realized this was a teleport spot here. Did I break this stuff? Mm. That just looks creepy now. Saying there's a treasure up ahead. Now it's saying it's behind me. It might just be up on this mountain. Is 
With all the hilly insurance they can eat. Hollowed out tree right there. I wonder if there are any other shrines that are located on this on this thing. I don't think so. Otherwise, it would have appeared. Old man is gone. Looks suspect. I left a baked apple for us. Hi. Ooh, is that sword back in its place? It is. I hope none of these guardian things are alive now. That looks different. I don't think I've seen that before. We have a picture of the rusty broadsword, but this is too good to pass up as a picture. Yeah, it's way too good to pass up as a picture. Knight's bow I haven't taken a picture of. Hi, chest. Opal. There's a frog over there. Can't reach me. <laughs> that was awesome. Well, I got enough. Give me a heart container piece, please. Heart container. Yep. I mean, I've seen at least four more shrines. I could go for ten. Nah, nah. I already said I was going to do nine and a full, a full wheel. I'll get ten from the boss, so... Not that bad. I'll be halfway done, then. Whew. Okay. Oh yeah, that's where the that's where the second picture is. First picture's right there. I'm gonna use the jump to jump up higher, so that I can fly farther. And maybe the guardian won't spot me. Fl uh, all the way up here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that other guardian over there spawned in since the Blood Moon happened, right? So they're both back. Or at least that one that we destroyed is back. Ugh. Ugh. Eh, what are you doing there? A little well. Probably something over there. There's a shrine right there. Do I see any other things that look like shrines? No? Alright, let's mark that one then. Mark. God, it just looks like death everywhere. I'm supposed to get to like over here. Right there. I'm supposed to get right there. Well, close enough. Wait, that pen's right there? Really? <whistles> Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> I hit the tree on accident, but it, I don't think so. I passed it. I'll just mark it anyway. Change the stamp. There we go. Oh, 
I'll be flying over this guy. They spotted me for a brief moment and then I disappeared. I guess. Who? If I get spotted, we bail. There's a lot of arrows there. I don't have a picture of the Moblin arm yet. Probably do have a picture of it. I don't. Yeah, good thing I can't carry it. That just didn't sound friendly. Hey, you better run from me. <laughs> I'm the scariest thing here. Oh, that thing gets too close. What is that up there? Oh, that's a balloon. Hi! Thank you for this. A little bit of comfort. Is that weird tone? Oh! That noise didn't help. There's another cork thing right over here. Look, it's Mountain Me. And now it's raining. There's something around? Hoo hoo. Oh, I see. <laughs> First shot. Getting really lucky with these, like, first attempts. Can this first attempt be lucky, too? Climb this tree. See what's up ahead. I see another. Oh, it's raining, of course. <laughs> Get out on this branch. That wasn't cool. That is... That's way over here. Get that marked at least. I currently don't see any other... Guardians. There's one there though. Oh! I spoke too soon. I'm here. I'm here. I made it. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, there's a couple of guardians nearby. I don't see the shine that tells me I have a memory here. I think it was it lying to me, was it? Sacred ground ruins. Nope, there it totally is. God, look at all the look at all the guardians looking around here. He's looking right towards me. Chosen by the sword that seals the darkness. You have shown unflinching bravery and skill in the face of darkness and adversity, and have proven yourself worthy of the blessings of the goddess Hylia. Whether skyward bound, adrift in time, or steeped in the glowing embers of twilight, the sacred blade is forever bound to the soul of the hero. We pray for your protection, and we hope that that the two of you will grow stronger together as one. Forged in the long distant past. The sword Gee, this is uplifting. She's making it sound like we already lost. Wasn't this your idea? You're the one who wanted to designate the appointed night with all the ceremonial pomp, grandeur, and nonsense we could muster. And if you ask me, the whole thing does seem to be overkill. I think I'm on the same page as the princess regarding this boy. Oh, give it a rest. That boy is a living reminder of her own failures. Well, at least that's how the princess sees him. Hide, 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 hide. So, I reminder of failures. That doesn't sound so happy. That is number one. Link is chosen to be the appointed knight to Zelda, princess of the royal family of Hyrule. Zelda does her best to facilitate the fabled ceremony of legend, as suggested by Derek. <laughs> but her own insecurities are laid bare. So what? She doesn't trust me, or does she not trust herself to do this? Also, we did see, uh, we, we clearly can see the, the Goron champion and the Gerudo champion. I don't remember what the Gerudo champion's name was. So I have one, then I have this. So Revali didn't trust me at all. I still have time. Should I go for the next one? The next one's just right over here. Would that give me three? Because these seem to be not in order. I mean, not in, not in order in terms of the numbers, because this is not going to be number two, but this is, might be number three, because the memories we get from contacting the... The memories we get from the seeing the champions again are activating his memories as well, like what we did for Mifa, which is hers is like, what, ten? Revali's was two. The other memory that we saw with the horseback was, I think, 14, but that that's like picture 11. I like how she mentioned the, the sky. She mentioned through time, and she mentioned twilight, which would be 
Skyward Sword, Ocarina of Time, and Twilight Princess. None of the games I've beaten. <laughs> oh, I haven't beaten anything. I hate myself. I mean, in terms of Ocarina of Time, I've gotten to Adult Link, and that's about it. I, th I, I think I've, I've gotten to Adult Link, and I've done the Temple in the Forest, and that's about it. That's as far as I've gotten in that. Twilight Princess, I have n absolutely no idea what to expect from that. And Skyward Sword, that's pretty much the same. I had no idea what to expect from that game. So let's go over here and see what this other memory has in store for us then. Because... Yeah, that's 14, but in the pictures, that's... That's 9. That's 10. So the four champion things are in between... One and t uh, picture one and picture ten. Hmm. Just take off towards that. I think it's right over there. I hope I don't run into another uh... guardian. We managed to make our way to the middle there without any any terribleness happening. So that was nice. Rivali's gale is now ready. Thank you, Rivali. So we're starting to get some of our memories back. We have, what, four? Four out of 16, 17, 18? Oh, there's another Korok thing here. Where's the other one at? Oh, there you are. Aha! Just need to hit three. Making me waste my arrows. That might be it right there. Yeah, because there's that little there's that little lip. A lot closer than I thought. I thought it was over on the other side. probably end this episode off then if we get this yep, there it is it's gonna happen here make our way to Goron City. Then, we'll need some adjustments on that divine beast so Daru can manage it as easily as possible. He's figured out how to get it to move. However, it's apparent that we still have much more to learn. But to think, that divine beast was actually built by people. That means we should be able to understand how it works and how to use it to our advantage. These divine beasts... So much we don't know, but if we want to turn back Calamity Ganon, they're our best hope. Tell me the truth. How proficient are you right now wielding that sword on your back? Legend says that an ancient voice resonates inside it. Can you hear it yet, hero? <gasps> Wait, where are we walking? We we're walking on this. Okay, we we're walking here. She said we were going towards Goron City. That's the opposite way. <laughs> we're going this way. 
Garden City's over here. So, does she not, she doesn't trust us. Ugh. Or she doesn't trust that we can actually defeat Ganon. Or she's feeling like super overwhelmed and just like doesn't believe in herself. And she's taking it out on us. So, will the sword be able to talk to us? Once we get it, that is. 51 minutes. Well, I can't think of anything else to do now. There's a Noctorok. Uh, I don't want to get the next memory because that's over here by the shrine. And, uh, we'll have, we'll, we marked the shrine too. It's by here by the shrine, so when we get to the shrine and get it marked off, we'll get the, the memory then. And then I don't know where this one is. And we have an idea where this one is, but we won't really know until we start, like, searching around that area. That one should be simple to find. That one should be simple to find. That one's going to be difficult to get to. We don't know where that is. We know where that is, and we know where that is, approximately. So that's the only one we need, other than this one. Once we get both of those, the memory should be a, a sn an easy thing to do. Yep, that was number three. Resolve and Grief. Accepts their commitment to researching ancient technology and still struggles with their own quiet anguish. Ugh. So yeah, in between this one, there's three more. Or two, there's at least two more champion memories to get. Alright, well, let's teleport somewhere safe. Uh, let's teleport here, because I can't teleport there. We'll just teleport here. Because we have four more shrines to do, which will give us enough spirit orbs to get the last amount of heart containers that we want before we start this. Nine's a weird number, but oh well. It'll work for us. Let's go to Beetle and let's buy some stuff. See if he has any high tail lizards or bass or fireproof lizards or red choo choo jellies. Because I'm not going to get a ferocious horn from him. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need electric resistant material or use an electric resistant potion. Can I get electric resistant material? Not sure. Hi, Beetle. Yeah. Seems that sharing space is our destiny. What are you looking for? Are you selling? I should sell some stuff too. He doesn't have any of that stuff. Oh well, I'll buy some. Take them all of them. Thank you. Yeah, let me sell some stuff. Oh, they're fifteen dollars a piece. You think that would be more since it's supposed to be extinct? Supposedly extinct. I have six of you. Eight hundred forty rupees. I'll take that. I have a lot of. Bokoblin teeth. Moblin fangs. Those are 12 apiece. It's not like 40. How many would I get for 40? 480 rupees. That's not a lot. Give me some rupees, though. I'm not caring so much anymore. Those are 200. I still shouldn't sell those because I don't, I don't know what I need them for. Those are two. 32, those are 10, 5, 15, for the Zolfo's Talon. I think we're good. Oh yeah, wasn't there someone in here that wanted to talk? We just kind of left. Crab and curry spice, huh? Or Goron spice. I don't have any Goron spice on me. Go for a bite. Okay, what do you want to talk about? Yeah. Uh, customer, are you traveling alone? Oh, yeah. Heard northeast of here, you'll find the Millennium Sandbar. Scenery there is every bit as lovely as the scenery here. I'm something of a connoisseur of beauty, you see. I simply cannot resist a beautiful sight. 
<laughs> I try to exude this in all things, not least of all my own beautiful appearance. Speaking of, is it? Oh, yeah, we already read this. Sure. Oh, oh you would. Even more beautiful on the inside. Now, let's see. If you head north through Hyrule Field, you'll see the castle surrounded by that foul aura. It has long been a den of monsters, but in its glory days, it was surely a thing of wondrous beauty. I, it was in that very castle, castle in those very days that my ancestor, hmm, my grandfather's grandfather, I believe. Anyway, he worked as the castle's appointed chef. I couldn't believe it myself. Oh, I wonder what sorts of cuisine members the, oil, the royal court enjoyed in those good old days. As a child, I would often suffer meager meals, all while dreaming of the beautiful dishes that might have graced my plate. If only things had been different. Gourmet spiced meat, seafood curry, mushroom risotto, egg pudding. Oh my, I think I'm salivating. And it's my pursuit of those childhood dreams that explains the fabulous body you see here. These days I enjoy my time working at these stables, sharing my tales of beauty with any traveler willing to listen. But I still wonder what could have been. Anyway, excuse me. I seem to have been caught prattling on. But looking upon your perfectly symmetrical face and discussing meals of beauty has rekindled my desire. If you should happen to set foot inside Howell Castle, could you find it in you to keep an eye out for a cookbook? There must be one lying around there somewhere in there. I'm simply dying to finally sample the food of the royal court. Royal recipe. So he wants me to what? Make him food? Any fish in here? There's a fish right there. If this is a high roll bass, this will get me enough for something. It's a Staminoka bass. Oh well. Well, let's call it here. We did get we got four shrines done. We got two memories restored. We got another we got an extra heart to our heart container count. And we got we got a quest to go find a cookbook. So, on the next episode of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Blind, we have four more shrines to do. One, two, three, four. Once we do those four, we'll have every single one we've found so far done. And then we'll teleport over to Zora's Domain to start working on the next episode, where we're going to start this Varuda main quest so until next time hopefully you enjoyed